Are you out to lunch with Mommy and Mima? Are you out to lunch with Mommy and Mima? Wow, you guys are so special. Dossie, say hi. Hi. And Sissy Scarlet. We just got done with speech therapy. She did amazing and now she is tired. They're also tired. Fast for me, baby. Slow down. She is literally, oh, peekaboo. Boo. <laughs> Pika boo. Pika boo. What does the doggy say? Yes. What does a kitty say? Meow. Meow. We're definitely still working on what a cat says. Good sweet potato, Darcy. You ready, baby? Oh, Yummy. Good, good job, sister. My turn, my you turn. Ready? Mm -hmm. Yummy. Dawson. Ah. It's a blueberry for Dawson. You eat it. Emerson, what is that face? Uh-oh, is your muffin all gone? Say, Mima, you better give me some more muffin. Uh-oh. Whoa! She, it's her, a new thing for her. She likes to yank on her hair. So, um, little miss something about Mary pulled her own ponytail out. You guys, why am I out of breath? Excuse me. You guys, don't judge my nails. They're not done right now. They're half painted, and that's just the way it's going to be. Okay, enough playing, you guys. Enough playing. No, I listen. Linda, Linda. I know, but mommy really, really needs to put makeup on today. I've been feeling like a boy, says. Well, see that binky there on the floor, you guys? Miss Thing, you do it on purpose. Okay. This is the last binky rescue I'm performing. <laughs> um, just a disclaimer, each baby is pulled far from the window, at least a foot. It may not look it from here, but they're all pulled away from the window. I've got their curtains strung together and secured, and all strings are also. So not that I feel like I have to explain myself, but I don't want anyone to be concerned. Also, another thing, people point this out a lot more so on Instagram. Um, all of the outlets, uh, I don't even know if you can see it. All of the outlets have covers. I'm in the middle of talking to my friends. 
all of the outlets do have covers. They're just clear and plastic. So um, that's probably why you can't see them. I would never, ever put my baby in a crib or in a play area with an exposed outlet. Guys, I'm not that crazy. Okay, mommy's gonna go do her makeup and you girls are gonna take a nappy. It's time. It's time. Yes, it is. Come on, come see mommy. Look at Scarlett's walking, you guys. She's officially walking. She started this two days ago. And now, she's just been cruising all over the place. Usually I have to like encourage her and put her up. Um, and then kind of like, you know, put my arms out and say, come on Scarlett, but lately she just lets go and she's been going on her own. So I'm so proud of her. Go ahead, have a seat. Have a seat right on mama's knee. They did not end up napping at all. We got home. Um, we've been out all morning and afternoon. The girls had speech therapy this morning and then my mom went with me today. So we went out and got some lunch um, and then we went to Target. And when we were at Target, I actually ran into, um, I ran into another triplet mom and dad who have 21 year old triplets. It was amazing. We probably talked for like 30 to 40 minutes in the middle of Target. And they were just sincere, kind people. It's so nice to run into other triplet parents because nobody gets it like a triplet parent. So it was really nice. We found out that they actually live like 10 to 15 minutes away from me. We exchanged numbers. They showed me pictures of, um, of their babies from when they were newborns. And then they sent, she sent me a few ones, a few other ones too, when they were eight months and now um, now that they're 21, they're all fraternal, so it's so crazy to see other triplets, other grown triplets, and it's also a beautiful thing to see the fact that um, the mom and dad are still married because the divorce rates for, um, for any marriage is high, but especially for parents of multiples, it's it like skyrockets. Um, Steve and I are fine, just putting that out there, but it's still just a breath of fresh air to see a happy couple 21 years after triplets, and they also had another baby after him, or after um, the birth of their triplets. So it's just wonderful to see a family that's happy and thriving. Um, nothing has really changed since the last time I vlogged, so I, that's really, I don't really have to update you guys on anything, so I guess we'll just show you lots of the babies today. all for today we're out of time that is a good one that's a good one huh <gasps> you are so smart oh my gosh my phone is propped up on a pillow right now but there it's on a blanket so she yanked the blanket to pull my phone closer <laughs> yeah, you're so smart. We're pushing this back even further, you little stinker. Oh my. I don't think so. There. Let's just leave it like that so our friends can see you. Stand up so you can say hi. There's all three of them, guys. One years old. Emerson. Darcy, Scarlet. What's that little smirk you have? Oh! Jeez Louise, it's a good thing this lipstick stays on. <laughs> that is the phoniest laugh. That is a phony laugh. Hi, can we say hi? Hey! Hi! Darcy? Oh, we're landing on my little toe. Okay, come get your pinky. Come on. Oh my goodness. Oh my word. I'm so proud of you. She knows that she can get around faster if she crawls. So she definitely still favors crawling, which is no big deal. I'm just proud of her. I'm so proud of you, sister. Emerson. <laughs> you are such a silly gooser. Did you hit your head on your car? Oh, I think you're trying to tough through it, but I think you did. You 
did. You did. Come here. You hit yourself in the eye. Come here. Oh. Hi. There. I say, Mom makes it all better always. Dawson, what are you doing? Are you mad at your toy? Why do you look so humongous right now? You look very tall. You look so tall right now. Scarlett, I think she wants you to share with her. Can you move over and make room for Sissy? Hi. Oh, boom, oh, boom. Say hi. Hi. Oh, geez, Carla. Okay. There's 91 wipes in there. You are very strong. Oh, you need to come closer to mommy. Okay. Hi. So Steve will get home tonight at about 7, and I don't necessarily want to end the vlog here um, because I don't really feel like we ever show our life outside of the babies. Um, not that we really have big plans or anything tonight, but so I'll probably do something, um, something at home, but we'll do something. Um, but sometimes when I, when it's just Steve and I and I'm vlogging versus just vlogging the babies, I almost feel guilty because I'm not showing you guys my babies, and I know a lot of you are here just for the babies. Um, so I don't know, I guess let me know what you guys think. Do you want to see more of my life 